We're here at the Adventure Lagoon, where all three contestants will go through the whole course and try to see who can do it in the fastest time possible. Without getting wet. Hello, everybody, and welcome to your favorite royalty-free athletic obstacle course in pools. I'm your host, Wipeout. And I am Pat Rick. Here today, we have three lovely contestants, Alpharad, Jaden Animations, and CJ. First, we have Alpharad giving us a, a test run of the course. Yeah, just so we can all see what everyone's gonna have to do. I'm sure this won't be tiring at all. We're gonna start off with the four pillars, then we have the little monkey gym, and then we have the man launch. And after you navigate through the forest and jump off the slide, you have to climb up the wall, pencil dive, climb up another wall, and then go down one final slide to complete the first obstacle course. Sounds pretty easy to me. It might be harder than it seems. So now we have to see our three contestants attempt that start Starting with Jaden Animations. All right, and first up we have Jaden Animations getting some words of encouragement. I just said staff. that. I just introduced her. <laughs> Anyways, Jaden Animations is coming up. Uh, this is the first attempt because that other one was just to show everyone how hard and difficult this course is. Give Alfred a quick little practice run too. Yeah, I'm sure that's not going to cause any fatigue in the later rounds. Climbing around at a, I'm going to say slow pace. I was going to say slow to moderate. Mm -hmm. You know, I'll, I'll give her it. It's her first run through. Yeah, I think my grandfather could go faster than that, and he's buried six feet under. <laughs> that's what I'm saying boss. Uh, roughly how long should it take somebody to do this course? It looks like to me about 30 seconds. If, if I were to do this, it would be done already. And here she has to launch our good friend Gina, who is in the launch zone. She could easily fall into the water if she's not careful. It would be a huge time loss. Oh, and she is struggling. Ooh. Oh, and she falls in with Gino. She got splashed. Oh, a high five uh, from Gino. Uh, I wouldn't have high fived him personally. Nope, that's a huge time loss to me. Good in camaraderie. Yeah. You need to paddle a little bit. You need yeah. that hand. Mm -hmm. So one way she could save time, she could have belly dove down the slide. I think putting her hands up in fun and excitement. Wee hee! Yeah, that, that's nope. That's, that's no one resistance. Could you imagine if an airplane had its wings up? That would be foolish and it would crash and burn. Much like our test runner who is still regaining his stamina. But you know what? More on him later. Yeah, it looks like he's having a fun time just relaxing in the water. Sure. Water. Probably start doing that a little faster. Where is she? Oh, she is drowning. Nope, she is alive. All right. That would have been death threats on our door. So but a great thing. thumbnail for us. Incredible content. And she is trying to figure out which path she needs to take. Unfortunate to her, she only has one option. Yeah, there's a lot of numbers on the screen, though. So mm -hmm. I can see it. You know, lots of confusion, lots of different ways you could go. You don't want to rush it. But actually, you do. The fact that we have a lifeguard on duty lets you know that this is where you should be going. Because you could die here. Yes, yeah, so I and mean, that's probably the hypest part of it. Oh, hello, Jaden. All right, Jaden, you're spending a lot of time waving and not a lot of time swimming. The thing here is that she could probably jump over and have a huge skip of the obstacle course. Yeah, that would be, oh, that is the wrong play. Let's say we have a 100 meter dash. Why would I do the 300 meters around, you know? Yeah, no, you don't want to take the long way around. No. Ooh, the lifeguard thinking that she might actually have to do her job. If I was on that track, that lifeguard would never have to do their job. That's all I'm saying. I wouldn't want her to, no. personally. I would just drown myself before I saw them. That's... Anyways, it's and just like that, that is time, time. for Jaden. Let's see what Caleb and Deanna have to say about the run. Six minutes and 47 seconds. That's Count a them. pretty good run, considering she's only seen one other person do it one other time, and they were making it up as they went along. How are you feeling going into this, CJ? It's really hot, and I'm just excited to get in the water. Do you have any other methods um, similar to maybe what Jaden? Power of the animals. Become a monkey when I need to. Become, ah. a, become a cheetah when I need to go fast. And it, at uh, the most important, become a fish. <laughs> so I swim over. Me too. Okay, cool. Do you have any Fish. swimming experience? Yeah, I've swam. And with those wise words from CJ, we're now off to see him take on the obstacle course, hopefully faster than Jaden. I don't think he's aware, but he is starting a little bit behind where he was supposed to. So, oh, and that's that, a fail. That is an embarrassing fall from CJ. Oh, and Jaden took the high road on this one, but CJ takes it low. You know, I believe that from CJ. He's all about going the low road. Mm -hmm. Very road, shady person in general. Yeah, very, very shady mm -hmm. person. Would not trust him with my car personally. Yeah, the Gino launch. Jaden fell in. Ooh. CJ all. So falling in. No high five though, which is good to know. That's Gino good. is reaching for one and CJ turned it down. He's a speedrunner at heart. Right, okay, CJ's a little lost. Does not know what it is. I don't understand how, if I can be completely honest. And this is a straight line. Ooh, unfortunately put the aviators yeah. up yet again. But he kept his body down, down nice and low, you know? I feel like this is way faster than Jaden's. I think CJ had the advantage of going second here. Jaden had experienced everything essentially blind. He got to see where Jaden struggled and mentally prepared for it. We I, all agree that the biggest time save would be jumping over, doing a little front flip. It could be dangerous, but it could be a victory. It would be really cool for the fans and the commentators at home. It's not about could I die, it's would I die. And yeah. the answer is, who knows? Oh my God, he chose to fall in as well. 
It's safe, I get it, but I don't agree with it. I, I would make the jump as well. And that is it for CJ. Let's hear what Deanna and Caleb think about that time. What was his time? Three minutes and 44 seconds. Wow, oh. three minutes and 44 seconds. Jacob. Shaving off about, what, three whole minutes? Yeah, sorry, Jaden. Jaden's time. We did say earlier this is mostly about just having a good time. So do you think you've had more fun than CJ did? I did have more fun than CJ. It's also about good. winning. So do you think you're winning? As you can see now, we have Alfred paddling his way to the course to see if maybe he can beat CJ and Jaden Stein. He looks fast, mm. I think, right off the bat. Uh, That's my I first know. cut. It looks like he's slipping a lot. He's really letting the dogs hang out. Uh, those dogs are barking mm -hmm. right now. Hey, this is a spider monkey technique, as it's been known. Oh, it looks like he's pretty... It looks like he's had a lot of time to think about this. Yeah, he, not only did he get to do the practice run, he gets to watch everyone else doing it. So if anything, he's twice as rehearsed, but also twice as fatigued. This is where runs go to die. It's when you launch the the man named Gino. Oh, oh he is his back. That incredible. was incredible time save right there from Alpharad. Right, he made it through that as well, going through the cones of shame. Ooh, oh. and shameful was that fall. That was a little shameful. I would be embarrassed to check Twitter I, after this. I wouldn't be, I don't think it's that shameful, but I, I do I think I would never show my face to my family ever no. again. And he's slipping, sliding. He, got, he took a ooh. second, had to prepare himself for the water. Ooh. There was a twirl, you saw yeah, the spiral. I, the fact that he went fast is very important in a race. Yes, because whenever you're racing, the faster you go, the faster you finish. I could not agree more, Bal. Pow. Pat. Sorry. You were at my wedding. Anyways, back to the match. It looks like he's too fatigued to even pull forward. Oh, is he, oh, is he, giving is up? he resigning? This is a massive time loss if I've ever seen yeah. one. If you just quit at the beginning, that's a quick mm -hmm. get it gather real That's fast. optimal for time yeah. to quit. I think he saved so much time, especially with the man launch. Every second that he spent trying to climb the wall, it should be clean. Yeah, he destroyed Gino and he should be able to get through here pretty quickly, even though everyone else fell. That's fine. It, I wish he would have flipped though. It would have been nice, but I like how he just dropped immediately he didn't ponder on what he should do he just yeah. committed and that's it oh a front oh he's just roll. rolling oh. and that should be time oh and is is he okay oh the lifeguard actually doing her job that is unfortunate that is a time loss for sure that is bad for our legal department if the lifeguard has to do their job yeah uh hopefully we don't get sued uh because he's just floating he is not really showing any signs of life right now okay if he dies he can't sue that's all i'm saying that is a very good point you know what i'm hoping for the worst yeah maybe maybe we can phone her and tell her to like put the head down but before we comment on the next match let's hand it over to deanna and caleb to see if we have a death on our hands Aren't so he you? is being rescued by a lifeguard life right now thank god alex is here. you never know what can happen i do believe that second time going through the course really took it out of him. Despite Jayden having the lowest time in this exhibition, look at this teamwork, this camaraderie from saving Alfred from what looks like drowning. Yeah, honestly, if I'm her, that's a free second place if I don't help out Alfred. But she sees her competitor a little overhydrated right now, being a good sport about it. I think it. that's just drowning. And despite having the fastest time in this race at a whopping three minutes and 19 seconds, it looks like our first place in Alfred is disqualified from uh, not doing too well. And for that, we eliminate Alpharad and let's move on to round two with CJ and Jaden Animations making the finals. And don't worry, he's headed off to the hospital and I wish that was a joke. Right, and Jaden Animations already forgetting about her past competitors, ready for the second round. You'll love to see that. Yeah, I mean, I think it can be viewed a little heartless leaving a man behind in a race like this, but I guess there's only one winner at the end, huh? Yeah, it's like what we always say. All of fair and water sports. All of our contestants came out today with one goal in mind, to win or die trying. And by God, did Alpharet take that a bit too seriously. But there's still one death left to be had. Maybe. Hopefully. I guess they could tie. One less potential lawsuit on our hands. Are we, are we going to the swing next? I don't know. It looks like a used mattress to me. Oh, oh, what is, what is, oh, this is like a balance beam, I see. Oh, she's crawling her way over there. I mean, I see, there's, it's like a risk reward here, yeah. you know? Oh, and she took the safe route That's, and fell anyways. She just took a dump. She was to go on the side of the wall. I personally would just climb on top of it. I would have jumped over it if I had been here. The shame you couldn't make it. Yeah, it's, it's a real shame. I agree. That's. Hasn't fallen on okay, any Okay, I gotta say, this looks a lot easier yeah, this is just, than the other ones. I haven't seen the second half before, but... Well, this is like going down a sidewalk. I think the first one looked a lot harder. This looks very similar to, to the spider monkey technique we saw earlier. Yes, yes, it's just, it's a little bit more advanced, you know, there's a little bit more going well, on here. Well, okay, I, I, I think it's, it looks so similar in, in the execution. I, I feel like there's seen more. this done with, like, more proficiency. I don't quite remember where, but oh, anyway, she made it past it. Now we're going through the fun house. And look, she's going low yet yeah. again, pulling a CJ, as we yeah. call it. 
Yeah, the, the low road. Mm -hmm. I can't tell. It looks like neither can the cameraman, so we're all in, you're all in the same dead? boat. Yeah, I think we're all in this together. Is here. she dead? Okay. Oh, okay. okay, okay. I was trying to remember the number for my lawyer right there. I think she's doing well. Oh, yeah. I saw her jump. Oh, oh and she is throwing balls at her to, oh, to make her drown. I get it. Yeah, 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 okay, yeah. I like that. And if I'm the lifeguard, I think I just pick on the weakest one, where it's no stranger that's Jane Animations. Yeah. Well, I mean, she has carpal tunnel. What does she do all day? Draw pictures? It can't be that hard. And she is almost making it through. And oh, Ooh. that ball was a swing and a miss. Did and she just a middle flip finger. Off the lifeguard. Yes, she did. It was a tactical defense, but it was impractical. And that is time from Jaden yeah. Animations on the second round. Let's see from Dean and Caleb how fast that was. Time are we at? Four minutes, 56 seconds. Wow. That is better than the last time, folks. And the anchor is finally out. CJ, ready to try to beat Jaden Animations' time. I know that CJ is very fast. He is a speed run at heart. And I've heard on the streets, does not last long in bed. Honestly, it doesn't shock me. Like you said, he is a speed runner. Mm -hmm. It's all about getting the fastest time at the fastest pace with no consideration for anybody else. Some people call it two seconds. He calls it a gold split. Some people call it gold split. I think it's the low road. And honestly, I like that he's going so much faster. He's actually running down these paths, realizing mm -hmm. Jaden was just only walking. Ooh. Oh, we see a football thrown and a miss. Honestly, an unfortunate arm on the throw and CJ he, taking the high risk, high reward. He is running through this. Does CJ know that he's not getting paid for this? I don't know. And I hope he realizes he never will, no matter how hard he tries. Yeah, we need the lifeguard to possibly interfere a little bit. And or he, give him a job. Out. CJ, right now it looks like he's He's kind of going, going slow. He's, he's, he's alive. alive. We know that one at least. Our ideal injury scale is pretty binary here. We either want you unharmed or too harmed to sue. Yeah, like anything in that gray area is no good. And CJ, where is he going? I don't think this is part I, I of think the course. He just saw the swing and he wanted to relive his youth. All right, well, um, he... <laughs> <laughs> CJ, okay. that is not the right way. <laughs> CJ, I don't think you realize this was not part of the course. See, I think he's styling right here. I think mm -hmm. he knows he's so much faster than Jaden right now. Take the dip. I don't think that was intentional, if I can be completely honest. Yeah, and you know, I think that we still count this time against him, personally. Oh, absolutely. This is nothing but a penalty. It's the, the faded swing penalty that CJ fell for. I get it. It's alluring. It pulls you in with its siren call, but it is ultimately a time waster. Oh, okay. The spinny. Mm -hmm. Has to pull a full lap around the parachute, the sunken parachute, I might add, while being uh, pelted with footballs, if I do understand. Yeah, I don't understand why he doesn't catch the footballs, personally, mm -hmm. perhaps throw one back. Well, if he catches them and we have dodgeball rules of play, then Gino would be out. Gino's out, mm -hmm. and then we can bring one person back in. Yeah, which I can see why Alfred might come back alive at that point. Smart play by CJ for not bringing Alfred back in then, Yeah, actually. no, I see. Just deflect it. Yeah, just that's a top-level competitor mindset. Just oh. take, go through the shit. I have not been paying attention to time at all, but if I was a betting man, I would say that CJ is well ahead of Jaden Animations, but there is only one way to find out. After he goes down this slide, we will see the times from Deanna and Caleb. Back to you. Three minutes, 48 seconds. So three minutes and 28 seconds there with his seconds. 28 with the minus 20 for doing the uh, swing. <laughs> you got me. Apparently the field reporters offered CJ a whole minute saved if he went on the swing. So uh, with that being said, I guess he's the champion and now gets to go on the victory lap. Here is where shows would normally give their final contestant a trophy, but uh, unfortunately we did not have the budget for that, so instead we just made him go on a completely separate final lap. Yep, and what's better than money? Exposure. Exactly. That's what every content creator loves. Great opportunity for Physical CJ. labor. Oh, he fell oh. off. Oh, you love that. The people at home are gonna write in yeah. about that. And he has finally made it to the final plunge, as we call oh, it. Oh, the big one. This is what everyone's been waiting for all day. CJ is going to lose all of his weight Innings, which is nothing, by the way, but he will lose all the exposure wheels since his face from the TV unless he performs a flip on the plunge. Ooh. I don't really understand what the confusion is with the flip. You kind of just do it. Yep. You, mm -hmm. you go in, you do a 360 in the air, and then you land. So Best case scenario, 180. There's nothing he should be worried about. Yeah, this is a win-win for CJ. Okay, and the lifeguard showed how difficult it is. She is a swing and a miss right oh, there. Oh, she got... No, I like that. Mm -hmm. He sent in the lifeguard to do the dirty work for mm, him. I see, I see. The low road never is not taken by CJ. He is thinking, he is thinking. Oh, and he is doing. Show us the flip. <laughs> he ain't gonna 180. That was a zero yeah, right that, there. That was zero degrees. The donut right there. So uh, we will review his release form and thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.
Alfred was recorded in front of a live studio audience. <laughs>